take a quick moment to thank everybody who's been subscribing to and supporting my platform you guys are awesome sauce all right I got my singing bowl yo so I'm finna get the energy right up in here singing bowl y'all always gotta have the energy right up in here i want one of my stones over there in the corner all right so i went on and pulled some cards just to see what type of general energy you guys were in for today and the first card out is rejoice in celebration that number is three we got material harvest that number is nine triumphant success that number is one and prosperity begins and that number is one as well okay so divine masculines it looks like a lot of you guys have planted some seeds here okay that you've been waiting on um you know you're, you're, you're waiting for the fruits of your labor all right and it looks like you're about to get it okay i don't know if this is a love situation or if this is actual you know seeds that you actually planted in the ground like you know you know what i'm saying um some of you guys are uh Focus on some love situation here. Damn, that was not a good shuffle, was it? Um, some of you guys are focused on some love situation here. Um, and you're looking to be um, successful. You're trying to bring something back to life here. Something that appears to be over. Something that appears to be done. You're trying to you're trying to um, resurrect this situation here. Okay? Yeah. And um, a lot of you guys um, are about to be really, really prosperous here in this next uh, season. Yes, you are. I see it. Some of y'all getting y'all drank on, too. All right, well, that just popped out my hand, so I guess this is the leader of the pack, the eight of money. Why this eight of money here, spirit? All right. Then we got the knight of swords. Why the knight of swords here, please? Thank you. We got the page of money. Why the page of money here for divine masculine? Pages of uh, rods. I almost said swords, child. Y'all know what I mean. Hell. Oh. Dang, yours just popping out today, Divine Masculine. All right, and then we got the Wheel of Fortune, okay? All right, so it looks like you guys were in some sort of work situation here, okay? Where you guys could have um, had some sort of conversation here with somebody that, that wasn't a very mature conversation. Like, you could have literally been at work when you had this conversation with this person, okay? Yeah, um, some of y'all lied about money or something. Yeah, or or somebody's money, somebody. Okay, hold up, y'all. Let me let me let me let me dig in a little bit deeper here. Okay, hold on, cause it's, it's something it's something going on her. Yeah, it is. My temperance here for the oh, I got temperance and then the hair fine. Okay, so. It's a possibility that whatever it is that you're thinking about got something to do with work. Okay? Yeah, maybe like you got into a disagreement with like your boss or some, somebody higher up than you. You might have said some choice words to this person. Okay? 
some some of you guys could have got um what they call that it's not you don't not when you get fired but um demoted ain't that what that shit called correct me in the comments if i'm wrong y'all think that's what it's called when you like lose your position and you go down like a position or two and you make less money okay yeah this could definitely be some sort of work situation happening here yeah you could have offended somebody yeah you guys could have offended somebody here yeah yeah mm -hmm. yeah so um so a lot of you guys um are awakening here okay you're going through some sort of spiritual awakening process here yeah why does ten of rods here yeah something is burdening you too it's probably like this pay cut that you had to take yeah that's what i meant to say y'all a pay cut that's what happened some of y'all went back to work but y'all took a cut a pay cut yeah and it's burdening you. Okay, it's also some love situation here you ain't been emotional about. Why is Ace of Cups here? Why is Ace of Cups here for Divine Master? Yeah. Yeah. You guys are in your head about something, okay? It looks like you're in your head about a work situation and a love situation. Yeah. Well, what y'all got going on today? Mm -hmm. What you thinking about? The Two of Pentacles. Why is this here? Why the Two of Money here, Spirit, for Divine Masculine? Why the Two of Money here for Divine Masculine, Spirit? Oh, you ain't talking to me today, Spirit? What I do? What I did? Okay, thank you. Sure, thank you. Yeah, a lot of you guys are really trying to focus on your spirituality here, okay? It might, it might be like, um, okay, so like I know y'all watch Tarot, right? Because y'all watching me, right? But this could be like somebody who's like very new to the spiritual journey here, okay? Like somebody who's not quite um, learned or there could be some really seasoned people here as well. Um, but it looks like somebody here is trying to learn uh, more about spirituality, focusing more on spirituality, Okay, maybe trying to get like an understanding of tarot and, you know, different types of energies and what they mean and all that. Yeah, because some of you guys are sitting here in emperor, in emperor energy, okay? So that's straight up masculine, okay? Yeah. Yeah, you got the ace of money here. Yeah, so a lot of you guys, um, yeah, I'm telling you, y'all focused on money and some relationship, okay? You got two energies going on here. Yeah. Some of you guys are in your head about this, this. This, this lady here, that this abundant woman here that you you thinking about. Yeah. Yeah, and some of you guys are concerned about your coin. Now, you really don't need to be, to be honest, because you got the Ace of Pentacles here surrounded by the Hierophant, Temperance, and the Emperor. So it looks like if you are having money issues, they're they going to be resolved here soon. Yeah, Divine Masculine. Y'all not going to have to worry too much about your money. But you did do something slick to this person that you're thinking about. You did. You did something deceptive. Deceptive. Um, damn, I can't talk. My bad, y'all. Deceptive behind this person's back. And they, they caught you. Yeah, they they caught your ass. They did. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they caught you. They did. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, now you guys are in your head here, going back and forth in your head about this person that you really want to have victory with. But you put this person in some sort of third-party situation. Now, remember, these energies can be interchangeable. So, Divine Masculine, this could be somebody who did this to you, okay? Yeah, but somebody wants victory here. But this relationship is clearly over. Remember the triumph card we got at the top. Somebody is definitely trying to resurrect a relationship here, okay? Because somebody walked away here. Yeah. But some of you guys do want to move towards this abundant person that you're thinking about. Or or vice versa, this person wants to move towards you. Because this person had a chance to kind of see this relationship from a different point of view here, okay? And they got enlightened about something when they did. They might have put the shoe on the other foot. You know how they say that back in the day? So this person is pro possibly um, starting to see things from, from different perspectives trying to get an understanding of where you coming from or vice versa you know you trying to get an understanding of where this person coming from yeah you, you're seeing this person as the empress we got the emperor and, and empress here so this is definitely some sort of divine connection here 
yeah, somebody got left out in the cold, or you feeling like you got left out in the cold. Either way, whoever is feeling like they got left out in the cold, somebody was doing some slick shit behind somebody's back here. Yeah, this is a twin. This is a, a twin flame um, divine union here. Yeah, you guys are thinking about sending a message here, okay? Or somebody's gonna send you a message, okay? You guys make sure you check your messages. Somebody's gonna get a message from somebody here, all right? Yeah, somebody might tell you, whoever this person is that you're thinking about, you could have children with this person or a child or this person may be carrying your child. Okay, that's a possibility. But um, this was some sort of cycle. This was some sort of uh, cycle here that was going on. So it looks like whoever the person was in this relationship that was being deceptive was, was probably doing this to like everybody all the time. Okay, this was a definitely a cycle. Okay. The world means that the cycle is over. So somebody stopped behaving like this. Like all this, you like somebody here is in their head about the deception that they did. But they also have a money situation going on too that's kind of, you know, intercepting them thinking about this relationship a lot. But they are thinking about it. Yeah, they thinking about this relationship and they money. Yeah, they is. Why the world here for Divine Masculine? Okay, okay, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, spirit. Yeah, yeah, somebody wants to resurrect this thing here and get back together. Yeah, some of you guys are afraid that this person is not interested in um, resurrecting this, okay? But for some of you, they are. Yeah, for some of you, they are, guys. You got the sun here. Yeah, and the fool. Yeah, at the, yeah, the, some of you guys, this relationship is going to work, okay? If you just reach out to this person and you guys have this conversation with whatever message it is here, you getting ready to send here, this person is going work, gonna to work with you to work this thing out here, okay? Now, I'm not going to lie to you. I'm going to tell you the truth. This person does not trust you, okay? They're afraid that you're going to break their heart. They are, okay? But it looks like they're going to give it a shot. They're going to try to work it out with you. So, go and shoot your shot, Divine Masculine. Shoot, she waiting on you. Well, whoever you who, whoever you think about is waiting on you, okay? All right, y'all know what time it is. You know what time it is. You know what time it is, Divine Masculine. I got the juice. And I'm going to give it to you. I'm going to give you the juice. Oh, oh, okay, hold up now. Shot. They done popped on, ran, and flew all over the place. Okay. So first off, we got Distant Horizons, Hot Honor, Unexpected Income, Family Room, Great Fortune, Change, Pathway. Okay, we picking up on these same type of energies with um Divine Fem. Well, mine is the Child, the Child, Courtship. Occupation, yeah, like I said, okay. Some of you guys, there's a child or children involved here, okay, with this person that you want to, um, you know, court here, the person that you're trying to get back with or trying to get back with you, okay. But there could be distance between you guys as well, okay. A lot of you guys, you I, you actually want to marry this person. This high honor card came out in Divine um, Feminine's card is um, reading as well. So a lot of you guys actually want to marry this person and move together, okay, yeah. You guys will be very abundant together, just so you know. A lot of you guys are going to change locations of where you're living as well. Yeah, there's some concern here. Thoughts. Yeah, you all up in your head. You are community. Yeah, I'm telling you. A lot of you guys, you want to, um, yeah, you're concerned about your, your living situation. Okay, so a lot of you guys um, here, um, like I said, you want to move. This okay, I don't even really want to give it all away because I know Divine Feminine be watching these videos. But I, I see I see what you're about to do, Divine Masculine, and I think that this is probably the right way. Like I can't say for sure because this is a general reading, okay? But like, you know, if y'all need a book of personal reading, just you know, hit me up because yeah, it, I, I think I see what you're getting ready to do here. And it, okay, for some of y'all, this is a good idea. I ain't gonna say for everybody, okay? Because I'm, I'm, I only read in general. I, I'm not looking at like your personal cards. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So yeah, 
Yes, yeah, so you guys could get some unexpected money too. It's like some money you didn't realize or or know was even coming to you. Okay, so be looking to that. Yes, we love money. Why wouldn't we? All right, so we got past life relationship. You have known each other before. Deception. Someone is wearing a false self mask in this relationship. Somebody need to stop lying to themselves, okay? Getting to know each other. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. Yeah, you probably didn't even get a chance to really know this person before you. somebody did mess this up. Love yourself first. Your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. True love. This is a romance of a lifetime. Yeah. Some of you guys need to get out of your head and go ahead. Uh, what, what was that song? Get out of my dreams. Mm, 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 mm. Get into my car. Hey. Yeah. Y'all need to, um, y'all need to get out of y'all head and stop thinking about resurrecting this relationship and moving forward and go ahead and do what the hell you got to do. Okay. While spirit got your back. Cause I'm going to tell you with the way, um, divine unions work. If you don't go ahead and fix this with your divine partner, the person that spirit assigned to you, they will reassign. Okay? Just know that. You ain't got forever. Okay? It's work that needs to be done. Okay? And divine unions are going to happen. You all have free will. So if you decide to let this opportunity pass you, spirit is going to send this person somebody that is just as good or, or better than you. Than what your relationship would be. So I'm just informing you. I'm the informer. Don't shoot the messenger. Don't shoot me. Don't shoot me, divine masculine. I just got to let you know, okay? But some people be like, oh, well, that's my divine counterpart. So that we'll be together forever. Shitting me. Shit, spirit, will we assign that person? We're all meant to be happy in this lifetime, okay? All right. All right. So um, this is the witch's wisdom, y'all. We got witch healer. Okay, so somebody in this situation is a natural born healer here. May bond. Oh, shit. My bad, y'all. May bond balance, okay? So, yeah, somebody here needs to um, balance their emotions. Shit, y'all ain't hitting things. You'll rebirth. Yeah, I said somebody's a spiritually awakening here. Maybe both of y'all. Lord, God, masculine, yes. Yep, you guys are definitely operating in masculine energy right now. And ritual invocation. I don't know. I don't know what the fuck that mean, okay? I don't be invoking nothing. I don't be invoking nothing. I ain't even gonna go there. I don't know. Homeland Foundation, yeah. A lot of you guys want to set a, um, a strong foundation here for this relationship you want to resurrect. And Spirit has got your back. I'm gonna tell you though, you better you better go and get it get it popping, okay? Now I'm not gonna sit here and tell y'all that every single um, divine feminine is willing to reconcile, but oh excuse me, there are divine feminines that have healed, they've done their work. They done forgave your ass. They ain't thinking about all of the shit that happened in the past. They just want divine union and they want to go ahead and do whatever they need to do spiritually so that they can get their rewards. So some of y'all got some divine feminines that's truly awakened. Okay. Yeah. So go on, reach out. You know, you know which one you got. Shit, y'all know. You can tell from the way they talk to you and the way you talk to them. Okay. All right. So here go to all uh, the um goddesses. I'm gonna pull some goddesses for y'all. Yeah. Okay, so your first one is Mawu, Mother Earth. You are called upon to help with environmentalism. I'm telling you, y'all supposed to be saving the freaking world. Yes, the hell you are. Coventina, purification. It is time for cleansing for a cleansing detoxification of your body and mind. Yeah. Yeah, guys, y'all need to take those cleansing baths, okay, that I've been talk talking to y'all about. If you don't know what I'm talking about, go watch my other videos and you'll find out. Sedna, infinite supply. You are supplied for today and all of your tomorrows, okay? Masculine, y'all not going to have to worry about nothing when you hook back up with this person. I'm telling you, this, this union that you, this person that you guys are getting ready to resurrect this relationship with, spirit is in 100% agreeance with this, okay? And you'll know because everything that you, when you get with the right person, everything that you're around, everything that you touch, everything, every energy that you go around, everything is abundant. Okay. When you're in a relationship that is a harmful one or a karmic relationship, when you get with that person, everything around you starts to crumble. That's how you know if you're with a karmic or if you're with a divine counterpart. Okay. Divine unions, everything 
everything prospers. Okay? Every fucking thing. Your children, your energy, your life, your animals, everything. Your luck. Everything. All right. Sorry, y'all. I had to be y'all mama real quick. Okay, then we got Ishtar, boundaries. Love yourself enough to say no to others' is demand on your time and energy. Okay, yes. Some of you guys, please do that. Okay. And then we got Sarasvati. Wait, did I say it right? Yeah, Sarasvati, the arts. Express yourself through creative activities. Somebody playing the guitar. Okay, my guitar. Eric Cura, blossoming. You are just getting started, so have patience with yourself and and the process, and do not give up. Yeah, some of this, some of you guys are are really just starting this spiritual journey here, okay? Or or you newbies, like within the first like year or two, okay? You you aren't really really seasoned, but some of you guys are, okay? I see you, I see you, I see you, I see you. You making your presence known? I see you, but for you newbies, okay. I've been realizing that I've been picking up on a lot of new energies of people who are going through like their first, maybe second spiritual awakening or something like that. Okay. You have to be very patient through this process. Okay. And even though you have changed your behavior, you guys, you still have to clean up your karma for the things that you did before you became an awakened individual. Okay. Now, after you clean up all your karma and you go through all your shit, if you stay positive and righteous, Everything will be will go be smooth sailing from there, okay? Now, don't get me wrong. This is life, and we is in America. So, shit happens, okay? But, for the most part, 95% of the time, you will see positive results in almost anything you put your mind to, okay? So, remember that, guys, all right? I just want to give y'all some encouragement because I remember when I first started off, cha! Woo! I wish I had somebody to tell me some positive words because I was like, whatever. Ain't nobody got time for this shit. <laughs> all right y'all so that's your reading okay thank y'all for being here please make sure y'all like the video for me okay if you need to book a personal reading or you would like to donate to my channel that information you can find in the description box below for you okay i got to send some love and light to the king i got to do it i got to do it love and light y'all later